How you going guys? Welcome to another episode of Night Watchers. Basically we are at another private residence and this is Jess. Hi. She has given us permission to come on her property because we'll fill you in a little bit later with the stories that um, we'll get her to tell you about but she's given us permission to come onto her property and film tonight. So what do you think Dan? Yeah I think it should be a good one. There's a bit of activity that she's been getting here so um, like Pete said she's showing us know during the night the different things that have been happening and stuff like that but anyway we want you guys to sit back and enjoy the episode and yeah this should be a good one i reckon also don't forget to like subscribe and share our content guys get yeah. it out there it's really important because we're right at that point where we really got need you guys to step up okay guys what we're going to do now is um just told us that there was a tell us a story about what happened down at the dam one day dad mentioned that there was an accident down at the dam and someone had actually died on the wow. property. Wow. And when I asked more about it, um, there was, they had machinery and they were digging the dam, like clearing it out. Okay. And um, the machine fell and crushed the gentleman. Wow. Yeah. So what we're going to do guys, is we're going to head down to the dam. We might do, what do you reckon? We yeah, do we'll do an there? EVP session down there. We mm -hmm. might do a uh, voice recording session yeah. too. Yep. And uh, yeah, just do a bit of film and uh, yeah. we'll see how it goes. You've got anyway. the thermal cam. We've got the thermal cam too, so, we'll so that's that yeah, part and well. parcel that's usually in my hand. So yeah. <laughs> we'll do that. <laughs> we'll definitely rock that out for yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. But um, all right, so we might get uh, Jess to lead the way and yeah. we'll follow her. Yeah, and it's just I'll down give you the us. torch because the light so. from behind is going to be a bit much for you. You just yeah, lead the cool. way. All right, let's go. Pretty much, guys, this is the closest we're going to get at the moment mm. to where the accident happened. Nope. K2 is going berserk. Okay. See, basically what that means, with um, a K2, it me uh, measures electromagnetic fields or okay. power points. It's an yeah. uh, electrician tool. Um, we're in the middle of nowhere, okay? Yeah. There's no power around here anywhere, and it's picking up a magnetic field. Okay. So... It's going berserk. Turn Let's it, get this. Um, hey, I'm gonna try. Oh, hang on. Turn it off. And off. Yeah, that's what I was about to do. Yeah. I'm just gonna. Do you want to? It goes berserk right here. Can we go off. Back on. Yeah. Yeah, and no, I see. Still going berserk. So, okay. We we can't say that is a spirit. We can't say it's not. But that it's really, it's we've checked it. We've turned reactive. it off and back on again. It's still doing the same thing. I can't really see anything. There's no there. power lines or anything here, is there? Do you want to just walk um, over there, right, like from, a couple of meters, and from check? From that way, a, a fair whack that way up to yeah, the house. No, it has so to on be. that back corner, there is that first yeah, corner on the driveway. It won't as pick you it come up. around the If bottom. it's a normal house, whole line. I can yeah. see it still. It's got to be within like a meter at the most. Of... See now it's stopped. No, it's still got something going on. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think. I think there's nothing electrical out here, dude. No, but it's just more the fact is that... Whoa, it's in the red, like it's non-stop in the when red. It, when it goes hardcore like that, Can I, have your phone for I start getting yeah. I start getting very technically okay. minded. I'm, you know what, was that your phone? Go back? No, it, ha no, it has to be like right up to it for that to happen. You have to pretty much touch it. Well, is, but that was in the red, dude. I didn't have a phone on me. This is where the person passed away. Yeah. It's um now with the electrical devices, how this thing's made to work is it's made to you got to go right up to the wall, yeah, and you have okay. to touch all the device, the um or the the appliance, and you have to touch it to it, okay, yeah, really, because the sensor is actually in the back here. It stopped, so it's still going. It's flicking off and on still. We've never seen it go this crazy from that's turning it straight good. on. That's all. Oh, okay. Yeah, so we're just a bit. In a house, we've had it happen like that. Yeah. yeah. Like in a, in a building. But not not uh, the only time I've ever had it go like that, Sunny Bray. Yeah. Mm. But in saying that, we debunked that inside a house because it's usually a piece of electrical equipment. Yeah. yeah. But to have that much activity so quickly, let's do an EVP uh, session. Just right, well, you guys keep holding this, and I'll um, we'll see how we go. You to hold that. <clears throat> Here, Pete, you hold this. I have to do the. All right. <clears throat> Where I put it? That's, that's non-stop. Oh, you've got yeah, the phone. That's oh, the phone sorry, right? Dom. <laughs> you might. <laughs> what we're going to do now, guys, is because um, the K2 meter is going berserk, 
and we've turned it on and off and it slows down and then it smashes out again so what we're going to do now is just an EVP session see if we can pick up a spirit or see if something's here because this is the area where someone passed away a long time ago so we'll keep an eye on that and we'll get this session Hang on. Now the first time you hear an EVP, have you ever heard one before? Yeah, yeah quite so you'll be fine. Don't ask yet. Just get in the um, screen, reco screen recorder. Yeah. Screen recorder's recording in two, one, go. Okay guys, we'll start off the EVP session. Is there anybody here with us right now? We have the K2 meter going berserk. And we want to know if somebody's here with us. If you are here, we'll come with respect, love and peace. And we just want to communicate. And all you've got to do is come up to this device and speak into it, and we'll be able to hear you through this speaker over here. You don't have to be afraid, you just come and speak into this device here. If there is a spirit here with us, with the K2 meter, take it down to the green if it is a spirit. Or well, stepping back. Did you talk? That's a dog. Oh, that just flicked straight back to the grain and then went full again. Really? Yeah. Only one. That's the dog. Yeah, that's just the dog. Alright, just a dog in there, right? There it goes again. Stopped. That flicked right down and up. Yeah, just. The gentleman that passed away with the accident that happened on the machinery. If you're here, can you come and give us your name, please? What is your name? That's nuts. It's like, the turd. it's like just sticking on the road. That's going berserk. When it's when it goes off constantly like constantly like that, I start thinking opposite. I start thinking it has to be a there has to be some sort of field, but but we're out in the open. So. There's no well. If it's, I mean, two minds about just it. Just stop now. Yeah, and I'm and not just moving. Just pan around and show them where we are. Like there's no electrical musical gear out here. The bottom on the button on the bottom. Yeah. The closest house is a good 40 meters away. If there is a spirit here, do you know that you've passed on? And now it's starting to slow down. Look at that. Yeah, it's slowing down, look at that, yeah. To show us that you're here, if you move away from this device, it'll make the light stop. Can you move right away from it, please? Oh. Oh. There you go. You're there doing go. great, thank you very much. Thank, oh. thank you. Still yeah. got some energy in Still it. Still got some energy mm. there, yeah. Yeah. If you are here with us, my name is Dan, his name is Pete. Can you say one of our names, please, to confirm that you are here? Dan or Pete? I usually give them our names, because they're easier, one-syllable words. Dan, Pete, easy to say. If there's a field around here, it shouldn't be dropping back, because an electronic field will just be constant like that. See that? Yeah, here we as go. As soon as you said that, yeah. it's gone right up to say, yeah, agree. That's unreal, that's pretty cool. Mm. Obviously you've got no problems with energy. You're full of it by the looks of it. If you can come up to this device and just give us any sort of communication or word that you are here. Sometimes this happens straight away. Sometimes this takes 10 minutes or so for, before you get to it. It really depends on, because with spirits, they don't come to your beck and call. Yeah, they don't if they want to talk to you, they'll talk to you. If they don't, they won't. Okay, they thank won't. you. Okay, it's, start, it's starting to work out how to use it. Yeah. It's starting to work out how to use it. Okay, you're doing good. You're starting to work out how to use it. Do that again, and when you do it, this time be clear and slow. Try again. Can you give us your name? Really focus and come to the device in Dan's hand and we'll hear you come through here. Try and focus.
How many of you are here? Sometimes I've heard footsteps and thought my mum was walking down. Right. And, and I'll, go, I'll get up and I'll open my door and I'll go to my front door and I'll be like, oh, ah, no one, no one there. there. Right, oh. Okay. We heard you trying to come through before. Can you come through? Come on. Thank there you. Thank you, mate. Thank you so Thank much. you very much. Can you come through? Thank there you. Thank you, mate. Thank you so Thank much. you very much. Can you come through? Thank there you. Thank you, mate. Thank you so Thank much. you very much. Yeah, that was that a male was voice. Right. We just got it. Whoa. I've got a screen recorder going, guys, uh, so I'll be up. Whoa, 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 yes. whoa, whoa. I just had a green flash go right across this. Yeah. yeah. This green, green. And then look at that. Oh, oh, look at that. It's, got, it's coming back. Holy dooly. Is that you with us? Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much for coming through. You've worked it out. That's the way. Whoa. I've got a screen recorder going, guys. So I've got a screen recorder going, guys. So What's your name? Look. Dog's over that side, isn't it? No, dog's moved now. I don't know where it's gone. Could be a dog. You heard that, like someone was walking, like crunched down, someone yeah. stepping on something. Could be the dogs though, mate. Mm. Could be, yeah, it's a thing. Could be the dogs too. Dan, come here. See the different blue? Yeah. What do you think that is? It's there, but nothing's there. And I should be picking up trees or something. You got a movement there? Yeah, hang on, hang on. Like someone's standing there, look, there's the arms, head, body. Anything you do, we appreciate. We're just here to communicate with you. We know that you want us to know you're here. Mm. So come on. Doing good. Come up and touch it again. Right up to it. Make it go to the red. <clears throat> If you are standing right here doing this, you should be able to speak into here again. We've been catching um, uh, disembodied voices that have come through on the actual um, GoPro. GoPro. Like the last, yeah. the last one we've done, we had. I, I was doing a sensory deprivation session, yep. and I heard the word Stephen come through, uh -huh. right? And then just after I said Stephen, in the next room where they were outside, you hear behind the camera and everybody else that was standing there, yeah. no mouths moved. You hear. Yeah. It's like sends chills yeah. through you. Or can you move on? Or can you move on? Okay, guys, what we're going to do now is uh, we've got our new voice recorder. Yes. So we're going to give this a crack, eh? Yeah, we're cracking it open. It's uh, getting used for the first time right now. Look at so. that. That just dropped off to nothing and now it's it shot right up into the red again. So hopefully that might be a way that we can yeah. communicate. Ready to go? Yep. Okay. Okay, so you came through. You, you're going strong on the K2 meter right now. You came through with your voice. We want you to come through. Speak into this device here. You might find it a lot easier. If you come up to this device in Pete's hand and just ask, I ask you to come up here and just say your name. If you're finding it hard to talk through the EVP, this is an easier device like Dan said to use. The question I want to ask is, do you realize that you have passed on? If it is you that's here, if you are here, are you the gentleman that passed away on site here when, with his machinery?
how many spirits are on this property? That's me making noise here. Ask one more question. Yeah. What year did you pass? And are you male or female? All right, what we'll do is we'll review it back now. We'll play it back, guys, and we'll see if we've got anything. <clears throat> Okay, so you yeah, came yeah. through, you, you're going strong on the K2 meter right now. Dropped off. You came through with your voice. We want you to come through. Speak into this device here, That's you might find it a lot easier. If you come up to this so device cool. in Pete's hand, and just ask... Uh, okay, can we just pause for a sec? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're doing a live at the moment. We didn't realise, and there's someone standing behind you too, apparently. What? what? Really? Yeah, apparently he's standing between them, behind them. Some, that, someone's seen something. We're doing a live. Oh, you're running live, are you? Yeah. Okay, right, eh? Someone just commented that. saying he's standing between behind them. To anybody watching, welcome to the show. <laughs> How are you going, guys? Behind the scenes? Yeah. So apparently you saw someone behind us, did you? Can Whereabouts? you give us some more details, Darren? Therefore, if he could see it on there, it might have come up on there. Because mm. this display screen is very small yeah. and probably can't see it with that. Mm. Just one thing I'd like to say, guys, if you're watching us live now, mm -hmm. go and check our YouTube channel out. It's <laughs> Nightwatches Paranormal Australia, and you'll see the yeah. full video next week. Yeah, about yeah, next week we should have it up. And, uh, yeah. So there's nothing coming up on the thermal? No. Well, apart behind from that, apart from that. As in oh, now, okay. as, yeah, <laughs> as in now from the... Let's have a look. There's no tree there. There's no tree there. No. Thanks to, was it Dave, was it? Darren. Oh, Darren. Yeah, thanks, thanks, thanks Darren. Nice thanks, pick up, mate. Yeah, thanks for pointing that out. How you going, guys? We're on an investigation on the private residence at the moment, and what do you think, Dan? So far, it's pretty good. We've had a bit of activity come through, and uh, yeah, we have to wait and see how, how it looks when we review it. But um, what we're about to go do now, guys, is we're going to go and do a sensory deprivation EVP session. That's a mouthful. <laughs> Basically, what it means is I'm going to have the headphones on with a blindfold, and then I'm going to be listening to the, uh, the white noise generator. Pete's going to be asking questions in another area, and then whatever I yell out is going to be related to see if it's an answer to what he's asked. So let's go do it. Sweet. Follow me. Hi, to Claire and I'm just trying to work out who else has come on. Sorry, Laurel. Hey, Claire and Laurel. How are you going? Hey and Simon. No, it's Claire Roydhouse, oh, Roydhouse, Simon, Laurel. Hey. Thanks for tonight, Claire. <laughs> oh no, it's not Claire, it's just Simon. Hi, Simon. Hey, how are you going, Simon? <laughs> cool. So the good thing about going live too is that people can see that everything we do is legit. Hey, there's my instrument. <laughs> What's he playing? Is that with Jan? It's an Ashton. Oh yeah. That sounded right, actually, yeah. Come in here, something. I know. Now anything that is in here, any spirits that are here, I don't give you permission to harm me. I have you have got permission to touch me, but you don't have permission to harm me. Let's give you an idea of how dark it is in here, guys. Okay, there you can see it's oh, uh, see you, it's pitch black. Come in for a second, turn the camera off and show the guys what we see in the dark. Come around over here and have a look in the camera. So now it's pitch black, guys. There's Dan, in the pitch black. Can you see me through that? Yeah, that's really good. To any spirits here right now, I'm giving you permission to come and communicate with me. Oh, jeez, dude. Is that okay? Yeah. Just loosen it off a bit. <laughs> no, head through the cave in. <laughs> <laughs> that's it, that's it. Yeah. Now throw my hoodie over. Mm. 
All right, I'm locked and loaded. Okay, so what this we're going to do, guys? Yeah. Yeah. What we're going to do now, guys, is I'm going to start the night vision camera. We're going to film him in the pitch black. We're mm -hmm. going to go outside and we're going to ask some questions. All right, we're about to leave the room, Dan. Dan's now inside this big cold room. Um, so he's got night vision on him. We're going to ask some questions while he's doing his session and see the responses we get. Can you please tell us your name? If there is a spirit there, what I want you to do is go up and whisper your name in his ear. or touch him on the shoulder. Oh, oh, let's get the crap out of me. You go. Steve, please. Steve, Steve. Steve, speak. Steve, please. Steve, please. Leave, please. Leave, please. Was it leave, please, or that Steve, please? That could be, please? no. Turn around. Oh, don't. No, didn't you hear that? Just no, like... I didn't. Okay. What does that lead to? It's outside. What is that? Why are these all cold rooms? Because this was a mushroom farm. They're still. Oh, cold. of course. We might do that. Yep, yeah, come on. Yes, I'm coming. I'm coming, Dad. I'm coming. I'm here. I'm here. You alright? And uh, we were just outside, Dad. We're just going to go up the back to this uh, shed area at the back here. We're going to do a quick EVP session up here, and then uh, we'll call it wraps for the night. Let's let's make a move. <clears throat> Jess is going to tell us about this shed we're in at the moment. Um, yeah, these are the original structures on the property. What's left of them? Um, so there's this one and one on that side. But um, yeah, these would be as old, if not older, than the log cabin. Hey Pete, look, there's two of your best mates yeah, over here. No, uh, hey look, I just floyed up. Oh crap, <laughs> Oh, what was, was that? Bat, is that a bat? Yeah. Yeah, up the top. There. No, there was a... There yeah. One just flew over there, there's more than one. Yeah, oh, there, so it there it is. is. Yeah. Okay. okay guys, we're going to start this uh, EVP session and we'll see what we pick up here. Okay, let's go. I'll ask those questions. We've also got the voice recorder recording right now too. Uh, the um, screen recorder. <laughs> Female, straight up. Yeah, that was pretty Female, cool. didn't even have to ask, ask a question. Screen recorder. <laughs> Female, straight up. Screen recorder. <laughs> Female, straight up. To the female that just came through, you have a message for us. What is it you just said? Can you say it again? And give us a name, please. So that's a question we can ask. If there is a spirit here, make a noise on the tin roof, if you can. If you are here with us, make a noise. Let us know you're here, any sort of sign. Ooh, hey, too, still. It's not as full on as it was down at that dam. That dam has really got some, mm. something down there. Yeah. If you are here, make a noise. If that was you, come and let us know in here. We heard that tap. We just want to know if that is you. There are bats in the ceiling, guys, so we're not, not sure if it's them or okay. if that is actually something. Come and let us know here. Yeah. Depending too if there's any high trees, it does any yeah. It could be a nut falling on the... Yeah, it could just be, it could be coincidence and timing. But if you are here, come and let us know here. 
Was that you? Give us a yes or a no. Was that you that made that noise on the roof? I'm speaking to this. It's still going on. Really want to see you take it up to the red. If that is the spirit, take it right up to the red. Really push. Look at that, it stopped completely. Look at that, dude. Completely stopped. I asked him to take it up to the red. I've moved away too. Let's see if it comes back. Ask him to come back. Well, as you're walking away, it's still flickering. It's only just stopped. Oh. Ask it to come back. Yeah. The spirit here, if you are here, come back please and touch underneath here. Just to show that you are here. Really try and concentrate and touch under here. Don't be afraid. Yeah, we're coming to love you. Peace. We're just here to communicate. We're coming in peace and love. We just want to find that you're here. Maybe step back a second, Pete. Let's see. Give us some space. <clears throat> It won't harm you, just touch that device again. There we go, that was a mild voice. Guys, I'll have it on the on the screen recorder, that's why we have the screen recorder for that reason. So. Okay guys, that is our second private home investigation. We'd like to thank Jess yep. for allowing us to come here. Yeah, thanks. No what did you think of the experience tonight then? Yeah, good. Yeah, very good. I mean, we had a few EVPs come through uh, on the live feed. One of the guys reckons that he saw a figure behind us, so we'll have to check that out and see. Wow. And um, yeah, see what that was all about. But uh, I, I really enjoyed it. I think it's great. We had a few things come through, some noises. And um, But what we are going to do, this is part one, we're going to do a part two. Pete and I and Em, if she can make it, they're going to come back during the day and we're going to do the dam and we're also going to do the log cabin just up here so we'll do a part two so don't forget to keep an eye out for that video guys and watch it because it'll be great one more thing i'd like to say what did you think of your experience tonight oh it was so cool we had so much fun awesome. yeah like it's it's um k2 still going yeah. off <laughs> k2 still going off yeah yeah so yeah that, yeah it's no, been going we, we, we're really happy that you enjoyed yourself and... yeah no it was great yeah. hopefully we've validated a few things for you and hopefully when we come back We'll yeah. Pick up some more stuff. I am a believer anyway. So. Yeah. <laughs> what do they need to do then? We've got you guys to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and also share it. And our uh, the links for our socials are in the description, so check that out. And uh, yeah, otherwise we'll see you on the.